Hey, it's Cole here if you don't know, and it is time for the long run, where finally, after 11 sessions, we are going to finish a cross code. I say finally as though it's a bad thing. I was playing on my uh, old file for a little bit, because apparently there's a couple of quests that I um, forgot to do. Um, and we're going to start today by doing some of those quests. Uh, so first of all, there is one I believe in Bergen Village that we didn't do. We will get to Henry, but that's not going to be the first one. Yeah, we didn't do the Xbox one. And it's kind of interesting how they ended up um, pulling these four quests together, and you'll see what I mean in a bit. Hi! Seeker, the loyal soldier of the United Voyager Nation, I assume. Yep. Excellent! The brother in arms is always welcome in this war of ours. Hi? Oh, don't let these moments of peace fool you. The next foe is always somewhere behind the corner. For that reason, we always need to get ourselves properly equipped with the, the best military, military hardware. How? The track seeker, the damn track, and it's all of its thrice forsaken energy by the ancients. Okay. And as fate has it, some spectacular hardware is just within our reach. Can we count on you, seeker? Sure can. Hurrah! Exactly the right decision, Seeker. Now on to your mission. There is an ar armored combat vehicle and some arms company that uh, some arms company once produced for us. Some of those eggheads thought it was a good idea to let one of them damn track creatures ride it. Why? Take if I know, Seeker. Scientists and their weird ideas, am I right? In any case, I want you to get back to get those things back to us and find the abandoned facility that produced it. Go to the old plateau in Bergen Trail and kick those heavily armed butts. Hi. The old plateau, you said. That's well, gonna be over here. Um, I was thinking of uh, bringing the rest of the party into this, but at the same time, this is going to be an instance quest, so there's not a whole lot of point in that. Ah, here are those guys. were there for a second and just kind of froze for a second. Stop doing that. Ah, the sounds of combat. Invigorating to these old bones. Those sure were some impressive machines. Just imagine what they could do in the hands of an able soldier. It's a damn shame that they disappear that they just disappeared after you defeated them. This won't be a problem, Seeker. I found the location of another group that should lead us to the facility. Make a move toward Bergen Waterfall, Seeker, and eliminate all opposition. Bye. Bergen Waterfalls. Where is that? It's over here. Yeah, that, that uh, certainly was a hit. And this time we got four of them to deal with, so, you know. Ow, ow, ow. Okay, this is why it might have been a good idea to um, bring in the rest of the party for this. Got a Calamity trigger, and two of them are dead. And now I just have to deal with this guy. Before he deals with me. 
Oh, that was too close. Yeah, actually, I'm pretty sure that was zero HP. Haha, <laughs> take that, you traitorous piles of snow. Yes, excellent work, Seeker. It seems like you mopped them up nicely. And you secured uh, that location tracking device that those winter soldiers dropped. That's right, Jewel. I had the, uh, that, uh, that one talent that prevents death once. Things like once per combat. So it should lead it should lead you straight to the facility which created all that wonderful weaponry. You should locate it and mount a full assault immediately to secure the weapons for the use of mankind. Good. You know what to do. Dismissed. Bye. It is indeed from the fire tree. Okay, let's see how... Once again, the eternal question, how do I get up there? This is the answer. There we go. So we uh, we have dealt with one of these on mainstream. We've dealt with another two on um, oops on the cleanup stream on Friday. And I missed this one somehow, so we're gonna do this. And by this, I mean falling into a hole repeatedly. Because I'm good at this game. Well, at least it just put me back here now. There we go. Welcome everyone listening to, to this either in our laboratory or at your home all around Shadoon. My name is Xavier Bonegate, speaking for Heavy Hardware Incorporated as a representative, but also as a passionate engineer. We at Heavy Hardware strive to create the hardest, most sturdy of wares, machinery, vehicles, big and small. For the benefit of companies, the military, ordinary users, everyone, everywhere, at every moment. For this purpose, we are uh, we are working together with equally passionate partners from various fields to deliver only the best of products. Using the sheer limitless energy of the track of the ancients, we are able to develop advanced gear as humanity has never seen before. Even cooperation with uh, creatures of the track, more intelligent than any modern AI, has been made possible. Right now, we are living in the most interesting times humanity has ever seen, and interesting times need creative solutions. With this creed in mind, I invite you to follow our work as we will present more of our work, of our future work in the future. I mean, I would think that you would um, introduce future work in the future. By the way, important reminder guys, take breaks when you need them, drink water regularly, and love yourself always. Uh, were there any other displays here? No, I think that's the only one. So we've enabled that. Oh, 
Okay, down to the lower level we go. Hmm. All right. Anything interesting on the screens here? It looks like no, just this one. We're going to have to start the test sequence in the room to the left. Cross boxing chamber. That doesn't sound uh, dangerous at all. Ow, 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 ow. Oh, jeez. I'm already at this point with um, only having um, killed the first group. So that's not good. Dang it. I'm definitely going to need more sandwiches, too. So I need to turn that off, like, immediately. Build a snow tank. Um, I guess I gotta do this. Forty-one point nine nine percent. I don't know if that's like indicative of how well we fought. Some of the carrot tanks were breaking out of the test chamber and tried to reach the elevator. Put some boxes here so it doesn't happen again. P.S. Good luck everyone on the other side. Open ventilation shaft. I guess we gotta go this way. Welcome, I'm Xavier Bonegate, speaking for Heavy Hardware Incorporated. How are you? Whatever your answer may be, rest assured that we will always strive to improve the lives of everyone, everywhere, at every time. For example, we are proud to, to report great successes in the field of fuel-independent heavy ordnance vehicles. For now, this technology is primarily geared toward the use in warfare, to protect our settlements and advance the new dangerous territories. Energy of the track? directly woven into every step of our production process, is granting us never-before-seen efficiency. The challenges of working with such a new form of energy are great, but by employing the best experts we will be able to reap their awards. We also made huge progress with some unusually intelligent snowmen generally known as Karada. We were able to create vehicles for them uh, that they could easily control without using their hands. They can handle dangerous work in even the coldest of conditions. This will greatly minimize risks for workers everywhere. And for our greatest project, we will equip the most promising Corrado with the most powerful machine we have created so far. I'm sure that because of our pioneer because of pioneering projects like this, our next report will be an even better one. Until then. Yeah, we know how this is gonna turn out, right? Boxes? Greetings. What is this? Why are there suddenly boxes blocking the entrance to our office? Sincerely, name it acted. Uh, re re boxes. A safety precaution in case of another breakout? What are we to do? What are, what are we on this side to do then? Hide under the tables? It's bad enough that the track seems to constantly reshape our facility and place weird stuff everywhere. Now we have to deal with our colleagues putting boxes in the way. This is ridiculous! So, uh, fourth reply, boxes? 
you are a bad team player, exclamation mark, exclamation mark, one. And what do you mean boxes are quite popular these days? They are in the way, we can't work like that. Alright, uh, so we have a box pushing puzzle here. Let's start by doing this. Which will immediately line that one up in the right place. Which I'm not sure if that's exactly what I want to do, but uh, what I'm doing. God dang it. Okay. Whoops. Alright. Because I don't want to move that one into place yet. Sure, if I'm gonna be able to make a shot from here, but let's try. Ah, well, I mean, I guess that also works. Hmm. And I think I'm doing this wrong. The one that I want to align here is that one. There we go. Now it's aligned. Now we can do this, this. Find that, find that, find that. Switch to shock. And boom. Alright. <laughs> Thank you, Joel. Okay, so we need to clear this. Um, don't clear that. Not right away. So we need to clear this, leave that there. Clear this and this. And I was going to go around there, hit that, go around this wall, hit that. We need to clear that and uh, this. So that it goes around here, oh, along this ice wall. We need to clear these three and get it there. Dang it. Okay. Fine. Ah! I missed that last shot. There we go. Well, this doesn't look like a suspicious room at all. Initiating test sequence, subject, heavy tank unit. It's a freaking UFO. 
Okay. Great that I got hit by both of those. Okay. Okay, phase one done. And now there are three of them. It's gonna immediately destroy one. All casual like. Oh geez. Oh, that looks unfriendly. It's a pretty safe bet that I have to hit it with um, the opposing uh, element. And I'll hit the actual center with a neutral element so that I don't overload. That, uh, that was a hit. Also, Jewel, can you make sure I go buy some sandwiches before uh, doing anything else? Just considering that I'm like almost out. I keep forgetting. And let me guess, all four now, yes. Immediately deal with one of them. Actually got knocked out there. Oh, I cannot take another one of those. Okay, I technically can. Playing super bad today, apparently. Also, it doesn't help if I keep friggin' dashing directly into the hole. Incredibly messy, but we made it. Okay, let's see. How do we get that check? Probably like this. Well, kind of like that, except I don't fall into the endless void. 
There we go. Tank. Tanks a lot, I guess. Welcome. This is Xavier Bonagate, uh, Bongate speaking for Heavy Hardware Incorporated for the last time in this facility. As you might have noticed, we have been met with great changes, with great challenges, greater challenges than anyone could have imagined. For all our effort, we were not able to properly control the energy of the track that has taken over our systems while po while powering them. But we are still proud of the choices that we made for the sake of progress. Because we believe that failures are the greatest opportunity to learn. We had some of the best learning experiences one could imagine. But now it is time to leave this place behind. The Corrado have been instructed to guard the facility. However, we will con uh, continue our work in a different place, one that will be well hidden. It will house the greatest minds of our generation to work tirelessly for the good of mankind. In the name of the entire team, I ask you that you see this project not as a failure, but as the beginning of something even grander. Because in the future, it is in the future where we will spend the rest of our lives. And in the future, we will work to affect the futures of everyone. Goodbye. Seeker, my man, th that was some damn impressive work. Not a man, but okay. Um, such a beautiful machine of war, and you still managed to trash it. You seekers are something else. But you got that data chip. Our technicians should be able to reverse engineer some great toys for that. Bring it back to me in Bergen so we can finish this mission. Bye! For visionaries, the future. Good evening, everyone. Uh, we've already seen this, I think. It's pretty much exactly the same thing. Entrance in Sapphire Ridge, um, part of the key, four different places, each in a different region. And here's the hint for Bergen Trail, between a laser bridge and the hidden layer of Frobits out of reach. So, first thing is we're going to go turn in that quest. Then we're going to go buy some sandwiches, because seriously... Then we're going to go do the uh, four visionaries thing. I'm going to turn in this quest first and then I'm going to go get those sandwiches. Hi! Seeker, my man! You uh, tr Finally you made your triumphant return! Leah! You can be proud of yourself, soldier. The data you collected will be of great use for our defense force. It'll help us to create many amazing weapons and save many lives. I give you a salute and also your award, courtesy of the United Voyager Nation. Oh, excuse me, I have to deliver my own report. Dismissed? Get a crap ton of money out of that. Uh, so. Next is food. We'll get that from... Shop. Um, thing is, there's more than one chest I haven't found in Sapphire Ridge. There are four of them. Uh, there's also a few in Gaia's Garden. A few in Autumn's Fall. On my, on my main file, I have finally found them all. Like, I found the last couple of them. Um... I found the last couple of them, like, after the stream on Friday, so... At least there's that. Um, but right now... We have some things to find. And I don't remember where all of them are. I remember at least a couple. Uh, thing is, like, on my main file, I hadn't found that facility yet, and I already had all the chests, so I don't know which one 
which ones I'm missing there. Like literally the only way to figure it out is to go map by map and try to figure it out that way. Anyway, um, so one of the uh, spots to decrypt these keys is right here. So to the north of a uh, big ruin, this is a pretty big ruin, so we're able to decrypt one of our keys. Um, the one in Bergen Trail is... I'll know it when I see it. Pretty sure it's in the off-road path. It's like at, at the border of snow. Ah, here it is. Yeah. Laser Bridge and Frobbit's Den. Uh, let's see. So I'm gonna come here, jump over here, and it's right around here somewhere. Aha! It's not so much Galaxy Brain, it's more that I looked these up. And in fact, I'm gonna have to look up the last couple of them because I honestly don't remember where they are. Um, plus we got the hints for those like, like, um, last week on Friday. Let's see. No, that's not the button I wanted to press. Come on now. All right. So the next one is uh, in Maroon Valley at a hidden source of water uncovered while searching for cursed treasure. Uh, so that would place it in Dudley Oasis. See if we can avoid these uh, friggin sand sharks. Uh, and the question remains, da, 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 how do I get up there? Um, let's figure that out. That seems like a good starting point. Maybe. Or not. So I have to go up there. I think I can go from here. Yes. From there we can jump over here. Over here. There. That's going to be in this area. Right over here. The final one is going to be in uh, Guy's Garden. At a crossing on, one, on top of one of the four tree stumps. So that's going to be at the splitting stumps. And I, I work to Vertiville.
Oh. This one's willing to trade. Oh wow, these are really cheap uh, veggie, fruit, and spice sets, actually. I think it's referring to the northernmost tree stuff. I think actually the hint was reworded from what it says in this guide here to say that it's on the northern tree, tree stump. So that'd be that one over there. There we go. He can now be used to access Facility X located in Sapphire Ridge. And uh, does that say... Start by name. I think in order to figure out where this one is, you're meant to just kind of wander around Sapphire Ridge. Um, and I think if we go to Carved Pathway... Aha! We're getting those blips again. Platforming is tricky, man. A lot of weird geometry to have to figure out. Ah, come on. Parts of this game that might actually be a little easier if you could just uh, jump at will instead of only jumping uh, off of ledges. There we go. It's quite the place they've built here. How? Don't worry, they're not hostile. They're just enjoying their best lives. It will, however, impede your path if they feel like it. Oh, geez. Oh, there really isn't anything, like, anywhere anyway. Hey, guys. Um... They seem displeased with me standing right here.
Yeah, they're just here playing a video game. Hi! Welcome, Seeker. Did you visit one of our facilities? Very nice. I'm happy that you enjoyed it and hope that you will also like what we built here. It is a smaller thing, but something we are very passionate about. How? Despite the accident, we still had funds and a lot of connections, enough to raise another small facility together. Why? We all became big fans of these fascinating creatures and wanted to give them a peaceful life here. How? We learned a lot in the previous project, so now we are able to run this new place in harmony with the track without any incidents. Why? Seeker, I am tired and playing this game against my colleagues. Please stop asking questions and let me smash their pride. Bye. <laughs> Love you, Leah. Hi. Ah, hey there. How are you? Can I help you? Why? The old facility in that tank project. Some of the greatest things ever, yes? Leah. You trashed it? <laughs> Amazing. We're always happy to create memorable experiences for anyone. But now we are we are able to create peaceful creatures that just relax here with us. And we can concentrate on our new passion, games. Yes, games may be a thing of the future, unifying gamers as a big force of positive uh, positivity. But right now talking to you is making me get my butt kicked, so please go away and talk to someone else. Bye. Hi. The seeker. Fascinating. You must have lot, a lot of stories to, to tell, wisdom to share. Sorry, that's fine. Sometimes not consciously knowing can give you a clear view on things, Seeker. Preconception, propaganda, all of, the, all of that can hide the real answers from your mind. Well, right now is not the best time to talk. Such heavy topics deserve a few hours of undivided attention. Wait, maybe later, Seeker? My. Hi. Uh, hello! A seeker, is it? Neat. Very nostalgic. Can I help you with anything? How? Ah, uh, well, our old project kind of went south after those armed birds broke out. Suddenly there were birds with weapons all over Shadoon. That wrecked our reputation a bit. Anyway, I'm now working, on, I'm now working with my colleagues on this small passion project. Not as fancy or profitable, but very satisfying. Just having a nice time with some neat creatures and gaming with my peers. Good stuff. Leah! Yes, on that note, I am kinda busy kicking butt. Are we done? Bye. So, that is our reward for our actions here. Four grown men playing video games. Anyway, um, oh, <laughs> no, unfortunately, that's all we get. Um, we have a hacker catch. Oh, don't worry, there's gonna be hard as fuck riddles and puzzles and some uber boss soon. Just not as part of that quest line. Oh, by the way, um, this guy here gave us something interesting last time. The Infinity Spiral Drill. Uh, one of the best weapons in the base game. Unfortunately, it's a zero XP weapon. Um... However, I think we might be able to actually equip this safely at this point. Because where we're going, we don't really need a whole lot of experience. Lady Leah, I can see you've unlocked all the landmarks. Splendid work. Now let's see. I can use a terminal to cross-reference your data, Lady Leah. 
Blimey, I can't see anything strange. Nothing wrong with the landmarks, that is quite a relief. Enemy data, coll enemy data and collection properties are all in order. This quest given by this Henry person were legitimate as far as I can see. Wait, there is something here. Some kind of outgoing link? Let's see what happens if I block the pathways. Hi? Well, well, I guess my cover is officially broken. <laughs> Lady Leah, is this the man I'm looking for? Sure is. Sir, it has come to our attention that you might be involved in author unauthorized activities. Additionally, hacking a moderation terminal is against Crossroads policy. I regret to inform you that we will have to suspend your account for an indeterminate amount of time. Try and stop me, <laughs> you won't catch me. Well, that is quite unexpected. I'll just have to disconnect him from this terminal then. Let's see here. This is impossible. I can't find the user. It's as, if, it's as if he doesn't exist. This should be impossible, Lady, Lady Leah. Either this fiend breached our security system quite severely, or... Or he's not an avatar. How? Lady Leah, we must find him. According to the logs, he's still in Sapphire Ridge. We have to collect clues as to where he's hiding. Maybe some of the players in this area know something. I'll search the surrounding regions from here. Please see if you can find out anything from the players here in Cave Inn. Yeah, this is a very situ a serious situation. I cannot find this user, user either, and impersonating an avatar just sounds too far-fetched. Help Baxton, and I'll see what I can do on my end. So, on one end, we, um, we kind of hacked the game on uh, Friday with the help of um, another user. On the other side, we get to help with um, with this whole investigation. Missing component 361F. Did Henry build these probes here? It would explain why we cannot find the object in the database. Put this up here. The money, whereabouts, strange device, and hidden path. I'm still missing the get a glue for this. I'm not sure where that is, honestly. Yeah, I mean, considering the fact that this person might physically be in the playground, um, that causes some issues. And Sergey might be working a little bit in private right now, but um, he's still an employee of Incitainment, which means that uh, this, uh, this affects him. Lefto, trolling, and one of the wings. Hands, Nancy 95, stranger. Person the player. Oh, big glasses, you say? Hi! You're looking for that weird dude? He just ran past, even pushing me to the side. What a douche. Alright. So we might just have to overhear some conversations here. Uh, that's enough. Girl sitting on a table. Yeah, 
Yay, okay. Top floor. Wait, no, the top floor is just you. And you, you're both NPCs, you wouldn't know anything. Um, you're a Ling. I really wish that the NPCs and the players would be different color. Um, Dots. Oh, you're Baxton, right? Let's try in this room. Pass east of here. Oh. Hi. What's up? Want to know about that path too? Somewhere in the eastern ca a cavern system, if I understood correctly. He said something about using electricity to charge some bots. Not sure what he meant by that. So that probably answers the question of not only where Henry is, but where those last few chests are. Now money. Yeah, you're just one of the lings again. The outside here, doing it every day. Yeah. And you don't seem to have anything useful to say. For you. I'd be surprised if the running man over there is uh, someone who like physically cannot run in real life. This other clue. I don't remember anyone being talkative in here. Oh, except, well, these guys, but I've already talked to them. Hmm. Alright. Let's look this one up too, I guess. 
Um, yeah, that's... It's unfortunate that it does that. If I can type, please. And return of trailblazing. This is not helpful at all. Let's ask around the cave in for Henry's whereabouts. And then doesn't say where those locations are. No, this is just a dumb site. Here we go. Nope, it's not helping either. It's just saying it's just someone who's trying to figure out how to work this quest. And um, then figured it out on their own and didn't actually post what they figured out. I'm also not checking a video for this. Like, it's bad enough that I'm checking websites. I am not checking a video in the middle of recording a video. You're just gonna be an NPC, so it doesn't matter. I just tell them to listen to their conversations, which I already know that. So I haven't seen any conversations that. I haven't seen any conversa any relevant conversations that I haven't already like asked about. And this is just gonna do exactly the same thing. Balcony? Oh, herder, okay. Running out for any real cash. Oh hey, you mean the money thing? Yeah, some dude just offered me money to deliver some kind of package. Just looking at his grin gave me creeps. 
Thank you, Jewel. Hello, Lady Leah. Have you found anything new? Wonderful. What can you tell me? How? Why, by using words, Lady Leah. Is something the matter? Leah. Hmm. I see what is bothering you, dear Leah. Your speech module must be malfunctioning, is that it? I'm terribly sorry to hear that. What a cumbersome circumstance indeed. However, am I right to assume that you're able to track our perpetrator? Yes, this will do then. You go on ahead by and find him, and I'll follow, I'll follow you by using our tracking system. Leah, I have found out more about Henry. It seems he is part of an organization called IHSO. Information about them is scarce, but they seem to be involved in various hacking activities. We have better hurry. This might get dangerous. Okay, hidden in a cave path east of Sapphire Ridge. So I have no idea where this path is. I haven't been here in like forever. It's probably not there because that's uh, that's an area that's just not accessible to anyone and Henry shouldn't be able to get into that. I might, I might have completed the, uh, the botany log. That doesn't mean that I don't like just destroy these plants, knowing that they will, you know, come back within like the next five minutes. But yeah, this is the easternmost cave. Henry must have come through this place. Be like that one glitch, and I just run across, run against this wall, and it eventually teleports me. Probably not. In fact, that wouldn't make sense considering um, that Henry may actually be a physical being in the playground. Hi. What? How did you find me? Why? I have no time for this. I only need to send the beacon. My job is done. So have some fun with my little friends. <laughs> Good luck. <laughs> you can control enemies. What is going on here?
Still haven't had enough. Let's see how you handle this. Did he just teleport? No way that can be an actual person. Stop doing that, jerk. There we go. Lady Leah. Um, you're not right there. I just witnessed your exploits. This fiend hacking enemies and forcing co players into combat situations? This is unheard of. We must put it into this madness. Let's move quickly now. Rather gloomy eyed out. I was unaware this player this ca uh, this cave was playable. There he is. He seems to be just waiting? Let us put an end to this mockery, Lady Leo. You are quite persistent. Sir, I've already alerted the staff across worlds. There's absolutely no way out for you. I'm also aware that you are, in fact, not a player, but an actual person. How? Oh, is that so? Uh, quite so, I'm afraid. How, how you manage to stay hidden, however, is still a mystery to me. Well, could, could an actual human do this? What are you doing? I can't move. You won't be bothering us anymore. <laughs> Why? Now, you. I can't seem to d delete you. But I can't trap you and let my little friends take care of you. Maybe you get tired or log off. This will never end. <laughs> what are you doing? Stop it. Have some more spiders. Spiders beautiful. Enough! My probe is not yours. I'll change its party settings so you can't attack. <laughs> Let's see it deal with these. Wait a minute. Um, so if he's hacked this probe to be in a party with me, then what if I make the enemies attack the probe? Yeah, that's working. Of course, this is incredibly dangerous. There we go. I can take care of the, these guys. I said stop it! You can't keep up forever! And shield is up, so... There we go. And on the sandwich real quick. I said nom a sandwich real quick. Thank you. 
Oh geez, there are three of these guys. Oh, power surge detected. There we go. What? Okay, so it's definitely not a player. But it just kind of exploded. Good job, Lady Leah. Hi. You successfully cre uh, completed a quest line created by the IHSO in celebration of the 2205th International Hack Space Convention. How? This whole quest line you have just completed was created by participants of this event. The goal was to create a scenario that was so convincing that players would believe it. Okay. I am but a tiny fraction of it. My makers wish to congratulate you in coming this far. We hope you enjoy the quest line. As a reward, we offer extra uh, circuit points for you to spend. Thank you for playing, and good luck in future adventures. You did it, Leah. So, how did you like the quest? Oh god! Dang it! You were in on it! Huh? I mean, why did I not just tell you? Well, to be honest, I did not know at first myself. Okay. I was really concerned that we had a hacker in the game. But when I went ahead and checked, I immediately, I immediately saw that Henry was actually just an NPC. The IHSO is an organization dedicated to finding exploits in all kinds of systems. They helped Incitainment to fix some bugs in the early days of Crossworlds. I guess that is why we let them have this much fun. Natural, normally the company is pretty strict about these things. Anyway, I did not want to spoil the surprise, so I thought it would help keep up the suspense. Yeah. But all is well that ends well, right, Leah? <laughs> Leah is unhappy. But look at all the circuit points we got. We got a point for each uh, circuit board. Let's go ahead and spend our points, actually. Let's see. Throw art. Let's go ahead and get our level 3 throw art. Oh, there was some funny text there that I didn't pay attention to. I saw complete, but that's all I saw. And let's get Chill Rush. That looks like fun. Big on guard arts. I'm sure, you could tell. I barely have used any all game. Dash art might be useful. Let's go with the dash art.
Hmm. So many options. Let's let go of that. Chart. Sure. Level that up. There we go. Spent exactly all of our circuit points. Oh geez, don't save over that file. No, 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 no. Read text. Spread up stands here in commemoration of the 2000 and da Participate, participants create a quest line for Crossworlds in order to fool the player base believing into a hacker has infiltrated the game. So basically, just exactly what we were just told. And that's exactly the same thing. Unfortunately, that did not give us any additional chests. Okay, well... There was a guy in the corner? Oh. Hi. That quest was interesting. I wasn't aware that the HSO had messed with crossworlds in the past. What about you? Ever tried tampering with air systems? <laughs> the right amount of patience is doable. There's a huge system behind crossworlds, but it's uh, overall it's pretty standard for the most part. It finding those little loopholes is what makes it so interesting. That's what hacking is all about: creating fun out of boring systems. By creating fun. I suppose that is one reason why you do it. Wait a moment. Isn't this room supposed to be instanced? Uh hmm. Alright. Well, oh, that's a mystery. Also, that took way longer than I thought it would. Um Also, that definitely wasn't a him. Anyway. I did say final episode, and I intend for this to be an ending or bust stream, even if I go, like, an extra two hours. We're finishing the base game tonight. Hello again, Mia. You think you are prepared to execute the plan? Mind that once once we start, things will have to move quickly. So, are you ready? Um, go ahead and drop one more save before we do this. Oh, 
All right then, let's get everyone together. Okay, where to start? I looked a bit more into the technical side of things. The new Vuitar server is most, most likely derived from an old version of official game servers. That means it should be vul vulnerable to a certain DDoS attack we experienced in the past. Oh, using the Hitstone Overflow issue. Correct. Oh. Now, please for us common folks too. Well, in other words, there is a way to make the Evotar server crash. Crash very, very badly. Once it happens, Sidwell will have a hard time restarting it. Thus, the server will not respond to anything, including queries to, to wipe the data. That will, give us enough time, that will give us enough time for Leah to reach it physically. That sounds very promising. So how exactly will it work? How do we make it crash? The keys are the Evo Towers running around Vermilion Wasteland. We need to subject them to a certain type of field effect and as many as quickly uh, and as many and as quickly as possible. Don't skip the cutscene. If we succeed, things should overflow on the server, making it crash. However, for this to work, we will need a lot more players to participate. That's why I plan to involve a few other players, specifically those Leah has met before. Involving other players? I suppose it's a risk we have to take. I currently see no other options, unfortunately. So, what about me? I can't enter the official playground, but I can move around for a million wasteland. Should I help? Hmm. I think it would be better if you avoid logging into the game while we storm the Evotar around. Since Sidwell is aware of your current location outside the game, you, would, you need to be quickly relocated. Otherwise, things will end with him taking you hostage. Right. There is the real life side of things as well. One last thing. Did you manage to talk with Gotham? I tried. He has been acting very strange, even more strangely than usual, and that's saying a lot. Once I had mentioned Leah, he started raving about how she managed to escape his dungeon tower. I guess he really left an impact. Anyway, I decided I'd better not tell him too much. Really, he's pretty much turned into a nutcase by now. That is worrisome. We will see if we can drag him out somehow. I know a few people from the maintenance crew that might be able to help us with this. Good. Then how do we proceed? For now, we should call it a day. As soon as I have everything prepared, Leah and I will try to gather the other players. And once we have the help we need, we start the plan as soon as possible. Alright, let's give it our best shot. That we will. See you soon. Good night. Bye! Leah? Should we log out now? Wait. You seem to like this place. Wow. Are you nervous? Very much so. Same for me, really. This plan is very risky. There's so many things that could potentially go wrong. Why? I'm sorry. Building confidence is not exactly my strong suit. By now you've probably already guessed it, but I plan to involve the other first scholar members. We will need their help in order to properly execute the plan. That means I that also means I have to explain the full situation to them and tell them about you. I understand that you are nervous about this, but there really is no way around it. And I am pretty positive that they will understand. Trust me on that. You are no stranger to them anymore. Also, here's something I should have said a long time ago. Thank you, Leah. We had such a long journey together. You went through a number, such a number of hardships, and you always kept going. Really, I could not have imagined a better partner. Yeah. So, what about now? Ready to log out? Bye. Good night, Leah.
There will be a stream break before Storm, but I I pretty much know when I want it to happen, so. She responds. Good morning. She looks scared. Well, it might be due to your appearance, I suppose. One moment, then. This should be more casual. Can't you speak? Hmm. That's something we need to look into. But you still seem to understand us, don't you? Interesting. A mute woman that can still listen. How nostalgic. Huh? Say, do you remember your name? So, what should we call you then? How about Leo? Here are images of different landscapes. Do you remember what forests look like? Well then, can you point at the image showing forests? That's correct. So you remember basic concepts pretty well already. So what about yesterday's sign? Can you still do it? You forgot already? Oh dear. Is there any sign you remember? Well, that's something. It's pretty clear now that it's not just your speech that's missing. Writing things down doesn't work. We can only get so far with hand signs. It's like you're missing the ability to recall words or any abstract concept. Yeah, it's okay. Please don't feel bad about this. Hello, Leo. Uh, always the same. Isn't it funny how it always goes the same way? All the support I gave them. All the things I did, suddenly doesn't matter, just because of conflicting ideals. Now at once, things have to go hostile. Sorry, this really shouldn't concern you. So, any more hand signs you remember? Alright, so you can still count. This is something you picked up rather quickly. No, back to trying this again. <laughs> Don't worry. You won't need that for any of the signs. What is it? You want me to tell you more about her? Well, we met through work several years ago. She's competent, hardworking, Mute, but that didn't stop her from doing her job. We communicated via writing at first, then I learned sign language. But even then, she was never much of a talker, just very, very good at listening. My job was all about having good relationships. I've met so many people, always busy keep me keeping up connections. Yet, I was also very shallow. With her, it was different. She was one of the few people I could speak openly to. Similar with you. I suppose I just get along well with mean people. So what? We're just humans. The world's most self-absorbed creature. We really like to think highly of ourselves. And sure, we certainly came and went far. But in the end, we're just another kind of creature lost in this vast universe. Leah, do you remember what a clear sky looks like at night? Out in the countryside, no town or city nearby? I hope one day you will. It's like a boundless sea of stars. When you see it, you start to realize just how insignificant we are to this world.
is done. My final creation. Time to put an end to this. All of this. Good morning, Leo. Hi. Did you sleep well? Well then, time to get everyone together. How? I'm happy you asked. I worked really hard and managed to add a couple of more words to your vocabulary. So we got meat. Meat? I'm sure that will help everyone, uh, getting everyone together, correct? Meet Mia! Exactly. But wait, there's more. Thanks! You're welcome. Well then, let us call the others. The goal is to, is to get everyone to assemble in the meeting room at the first scholar's queue. Let's move there first, shall we? Of course nobody is here. That would have been too easy. Well, now let's try to contact everyone via D-Link. Time to use your new vocabulary. Hi! Oh, bonjour, Léa! It's good to see you still in the game. Johnny has been offline for several days now. I suppose he's gone for good. He didn't even say goodbye in that dork. Oh well, so what's up? Shall we start a party? Meet! I'll go. Meet Leah! Um, you want to meet? Where should we meet? Leah, wait! Um... Oh, you'll wait to meet me at your current location. Well then, let me check. Ah, you're at the headquarters. I'll be right there. Thanks! You're surprisingly talkative today, Shay. See you soon. Bye! Hey, that worked better than I expected. Oh, hello, Leia. Hi. Sorry. Huh? Leia, sorry. Um... Oh, you mean about what happened before? Yeah, it was just a hug. Don't worry about it. It wasn't even that strong. No broken spine. All good. <laughs> no, really. It's all yesterday's snow to me. Meet Leah. Um, what now again? Meet Leah. Um, I don't know. Don't you think this is a bit too soon? Just one hug, and now you want me to? You want to meet me privately in there? <laughs> Lucas, please. Why? <laughs> I'm just messing with you. I'm sorry. You want to have a meeting with all first scholar members? All right, I can get everyone together if you like. Thanks. No worries. Give me give me a moment. I'll be right back. Great, Schneider helping out will make this a lot easier. Well then, next let us call Apollo and Jorn. We, we need all the help we can get, Mia. Hi! Hello, Leah. Experimental Leah, it's good to see you. Leah, meet! Excuse me? Meet, meet Leah. I think she wants us to meet her. So, does this mean you're ready for our next duel? No, not exactly. This is a very comfy building for an HQ. I like it. Why, thank you! But finally, I meet the, fam the famous grasshead I've heard so much about. The name's Apollo, tribe later. By the way, aren't we all just grassheads of different colors? <laughs> You're right. Well, at least I have the color fresh grass. Yes, but I am the wise grasshead. Listen to your elder greenhorn. Alright, screw these metaphors. Hi! Hi, everyone. Let's hear what Leah has to say. Leah. Neat. I'm loving it so far. 
the uh, the hologram number. I forgot the number. Um, hello, everyone. Suck him, dude. My name is Lilia. Who is that guy? I was just, Emily. Let Emily just let him talk. Thank you. My name is Sergei Asimov, and I'm here to explain Nia's circumstances to you. All of you should be aware of her speech modulations by now. However, there is another aspect of Leah you are probably unaware of. Leah is an AI. Her, art her, av her avatar is controlled by an artificial intelligence. What? I'm joking. Experiments for Leah! Does this man tell the truth? Sorry. No way, that can't be true. You definitely fooled me. So, wait, does that mean a bot managed to join our guild? <laughs> this is amazing. Mia, dear, so are... are you an NPC? I'm very confused right now. Mia is a regular avatar, controlled by a very special kind of AI. Allow me to start from the beginning. We finally met Satoshi in, uh, Satoshi in Shiskav, hidden somewhere in Sapphire Ridge. That is how we learned everything and how we could come up with a plan. A plan to storm Vermilion Wasteland to reach the Yuvatar server. And that, that is where we are at right now. Damn, what a convoluted situation. It's where man's with Leah. I don't know how to respond to this. All this tech talk just went way over my head. But what was this part about punching through dungeon walls? That sounded awesome. I'm still so, so confused. Don't worry, hon. This situation is very particular. Okay, now this is where you come in. In order to properly storm Vermilion Wasteland, we need your help. So please, for the sake of Leah and all evil tars, can we count on your support? We oui, Count me in! Leah is a dear friend to me. She can be an AI or a loaf of baguette for all I care. Of course I'll help her. You're right. Leah is a member of this guild and we should support her. Sure, this, cr this situation is crazy and the storming Vermilion Wasteland might get us into trouble. But how often do we get the, the chance to break into unfinished game territory, am I right? True words, my dude. This sounds like a crazy kind of raid. Not sure I can approve of all this rule-breaking behavior. However, the way Vuitars are currently treated is a disgusting display of injustice. By the name and the honor of the Sphere this cannot stand. Second it. Very true. We first scholars cannot abide such cruelty. Mia, you have our support. Indeed. Also, everyone get down from that table. Yes, ma'am. Thanks. Thanks, thanks, thanks! Honestly, I never expected this amount of enthusiasm. I'm very glad to have you. we have you on our side. Now we just have to find a good name that fits everyone. The sooner the better. It's a uh, good time, rather. It's the weekend, and I have time. Let's do it today. Let's... Yes, let's store Vermilion Wasteland. Sure, today is good. I was planning on doing some shopping today. That was a joke. Alright, today it is. Fantastic. Then let us meet uh, let us meet in about an hour in front of the dojo in Sapphire Ridge. The entrance to Vermilion Wasteland is nearby. Also, before you leave, we should try to establish a direct communication channel. Please give me a moment. We're all set. Now I can talk directly to all of you. Nice. Then I'll optimize my equipment. My no, quickly optimize my equipment and gather a few items. See you soon. Alrighty, all night. Bear prepare as well. Soon. Uh, Sergey, quick question. You said there was an Evotar copy of me in Evotar ground, potentially interrogated. Yes, that is correct. Ah, uh, young. I better log out and quickly change all of my credentials. I'll meet you in Sapphire Ridge. 
Spearman's or Leah, we shall prepare as well. We'll show them what it means to, to deal with the wrath of the Spearmancers. Yeah, Shay. Now I finally understand what has been going on with you. You must really miss him now. The other Lucas and Evotar around. We'll get him out of there, promise. Damn it! I'm gonna kick Sidwell's death out so hard, he'll never sit well again. That's a nice pun. I didn't <laughs> I didn't realize that pun until I said it out loud. Ah, oh, gotta prepare. Kicks out Sidwell's Sidwell's butt so hard, he'll never sit well again. I guess that is it. We are all set. Let us meet with everyone else at the dojo in Sapphire Ridge. We had better be prepared as well. Uh, traitor thing? Oh. Uh, that's unresolved, but um, we gotta work with the resources that we have, so, you know. So let's go ahead and make sure that all of our equipment is a decent level. Um, well, our equipment average is 62, our level is 63. I think we're pretty much good. I'm gonna create a new save file because we have passed the point of no return yet. Anyway, um, so with that, we're going to take a break, and when we come back from that break, it is time to storm Vermilion Wasteland and put an end to this strange plot that uh, Lee has been stuck in for pretty much all of her existence at this point, I guess. Anyway, I will see you in a bit. <laughs> 